many folds and faults in the outcrops of the Ordovician, Silurian, and Devonian tell the story of the intense deformation of the area. The rocks that formed the Arbuckles were originally deposited flat-lying in an ocean basin. When continents came together and collided in a giant jumbo car crash of continents, all of the rocks were uplifted. That uplift became the Arbuckle Anticline. The area's unique geology creates a series of stony hills and valleys that make a perfect home for wildlife, both native and otherwise. Hundreds of unique and exotic types of wildlife roam the over 400 acres of Arbuckle Wilderness, one of the top tourist attractions in Oklahoma. Everything from uh, the animals, which is the interactive uh, uh, venue here, as well as uh, uh, just getting out with the family. It's a family uh, event. Uh, it's something that's a little bit for everyone, from the old to the young. What do you think about the rocks around this place, eh? Yeah? Pretty cool, eh? What's your favorite part? You just like the food, don't you? and there's a lot of different outcrops that they can see that they can see no other place uh, besides here. During the Pennsylvania, in this intense mountain building process, heat and pressure was intense at depths well below today's Earth's surface. These rocks were uplifted and folded into very tight folded patterns, like the one you see here. You can see these beds come down and form a nice chevron fold in this shale unit. During the uplift of the Wachita's and the Arbuckles, some area rocks were eroded to create thick layers of conglomerate that were laid down over the faulted and folded beds. 